It is another tool in the toolbox to fight COVID-19, as the governor calls it. And now the new Johnson & Johnson vaccine is in the hands of local health professionals. That means they say more people will be getting protected from COVID-19 faster. And for some, just one dose. With the latest on the vaccine efforts in southeastern Minnesota, Mackenzie Davis joins me in studio with the latest. Mackenzie. Betsy, that's right. Local health officials have had high hopes for the new one dose Johnson and Johnson vaccine to help speed up the process of vaccination, especially right here in Olmstead County. Mayo Clinic in Rochester has now received doses of all three vaccines. We are um, very excited to receive the J&J &J vaccine as well as uh, the Pfizer and Moderna vaccine. Getting closer to hitting that goal of 70% of seniors in Minnesota getting vaccinated by the end of March. About 64.1% of county residents over the age of 65 have received at least one dose of vaccine. Olmstead County remains near the top as far as counties go in Minnesota for the highest percentage of residents vaccinated. The addition of the Johnson Johnson vaccine helps release a little bit of pressure on the system. You know, we still don't have enough vaccine to vaccinate everybody next week, but uh, we have a little bit more vaccine uh, uh, within reach now. And Olmsted County Public Health says by the end of this week, all school employees in the county will have been offered their first dose. We don't know exactly where MDH will decide to push vaccine to. I'm also assuming here that uh, uh, coming through the federal government that I, I wouldn't be surprised if J&J &J vaccine is going out directly to some of the, the pharmacies through the agreements that they've got here in the near future. We have proof that the vaccines work, they protect us, and Briggs describes it as a miracle. Just a year after the emergence of a novel virus, to have this available as a tool to stop a pandemic is something we've never done in human history before. Mayo Clinic says the COVID-19 vaccine will likely be an annual vaccine, just like the flu shot. There might even be a two-in-one shot each year with the flu and COVID shots combined. However, it's hard for health officials to make those predictions this early on. Betsy.